again, as you notice, they give it a right in front of you. That is the toll plaza. And of course, as you notice, every each one of these cars, they have to pay this toll. That is six thousand. Wow, today is only four dollars. I don't. Wow, that's a bargain. Well, of course, during the rush hour, they give it six dollars. And then, of course, uh, during uh, night, like um, after 9 p.m., it's only $4. But it used to be $5. They went down to $4. Well, because what it is, they get a few of a pass track, like the one I had. Of course, that is, they will deduct $1. So if you don't have a pass track, like a machine, and of course, they will charge you $5, okay? Now, again, uh, the we are now uh, entering again the San Francisco Oakland Bay Bridge. I mentioned to you, this is the second longest bridge in the state of California. It didn't have miles long. Now, as you can see, the San Francisco side, it is truly a suspension bridge. Now, you know, this is the only bridge that is also needed at night. The Golden Gate Bridge, it is not needed at night. Only the San Francisco, Oakland, Bay Bridge, okay? But then again, you'll notice now that the sign of the Oakland part of the bridge, this is not a suspension. This is a cancel lever bridge. Now again, as soon as we start swinging to your left, I'd like you to look at the pavement. You can see it. You can hear it. You can feel it. This is the one that collapsed in 1989. Loma Predator Bay. Coming up. Now, here we go. Look at the pavement beyond that sign, 50 miles per hour. And here is the pavement right here. Bam, see? I told you, you're going to be okay today. I don't know about tomorrow. Well, of course, Lady Jonah, let me just eat five minutes of your time. I just want to show you one last thing, Lady Jonah, the one that I promised to you. And as I mentioned to you, since that we're on the position now, let me just show you to you what is really San Francisco by night, okay? Again, you will never going to see this in any given tour in the city of San Francisco. But then again, uh, you realize that you're on the right-hand side, that is a man-made island again, that is our treasure island. And of course, right in front of you, right below uh, below us, they have, of course, uh, underneath the bridge, that is the Yerba Buena Island. That is the home for our United States Coast Guard here. But then again, uh, as you can see, they're tonight, it's a beautiful night in San Francisco. And the reason why I say that, if you could see a red blinking light to your right hand side about one o'clock, there you go. Of course, the very far end, that is the Golden Gate Bridge. If you could see the Golden Gate Bridge to this point here, there you go, and then again, you have a good night here in San Francisco. Not foggy. It's a clear sky tonight, there you go. And of course, uh, you just have to prepare your camera now, there you go. This is only going to happen. One time, okay? And now we welcome you to the Yep Papuera Island, okay? And of course, I'll let you know look right in front of this motor coach to your left hand side. I'll show you the San Francisco, Oakland, the bridge. And there she is. Bam, to your left hand side. And again, one more time, to your left hand side. And there she is. That is the big bridge, they you know? And you're looking at it right now. Of course, it's always nice 
to a photograph the answer with the moon stage I don't know if you can see that but then again if you keep on looking again to your left hand side I'll show you San Francisco by night don't worry ladies and gentlemen I'm going to let you off for five minutes and of course I promise you let me just eat five minutes out of your time and then again to your left hand side ladies and this is the Wall Street of the West and there she is And now you are now officially in our treasure island. Again, this is a man-made island. This used to be our naval station in San Francisco. Now this, this naval station is now closed because the Cold War is over. And you're at 60 degrees here in San Francisco tonight. But then again, if you notice, do you realize how close you are now to the Golden Gate Bridge? Do you also realize how close you are now to the maximum penitentiary of Alcatraz? As I mentioned to you, Alcatraz, in English means the Belgian. But then again, if you look to the right hand side, they give this the Oakland part of the bridge. As you can see, see it's not a see it's not a suspension. See it a cantilever bridge. As I promise you, I'm going to let you off for five minutes, and after that, we will go home, okay? And if you're hungry, there's a hot, hot dog stand right here, right next to you. And also, if you're thirsty, they have bottled water there and soda. Okay, guys, five minutes. Let's go, please. How do you make it? <laughs> Focus on work. Of course, uh, you are now officially in San Francisco. This is the city, by the way. As I mentioned to you, later on, this city is only 49 square mile city. But if you ever want to eat out in the city of San Francisco every single day, it will take you six years and 75 days before you finish all the restaurants here in San Francisco. That's how much restaurants we have in the city of San Francisco because we do not want those starving tourists. And of course, I had a lady who were asking me a little earlier today, and he said to me, and she said to me, Leo, I took a city tour yesterday from your company. How come the guy or the driver never took us to the Crooked Prison Room? Well, I'm sorry, Leo, we won't be able to take a motorcoach to the Crooked Prison Room because of the accident that happened about three days ago. One of our competition motorcoach operator driver named Ramon somehow didn't realize he's driving a bus. 
He took his bus to the crooked city road. So therefore, we had to cut the bus in half and lift it out by helicopter. So he doesn't work there no more. Now he works for us. I hope he didn't buy that, right? That is just a joke. We're not going to pay that the crooked city road, okay? That's what it is, okay? Now, of course, uh, right in front of you again, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see all these buildings in front of you, that is the Wall Street of the West. So, Palace, in about two minutes, you're home, okay? And I know I have some people who are going to Alcatraz tomorrow. And of course, after you go to Alcatraz, you're going to want to own an Alcatraz t shirt as a souvenir, right? But then again, if you try to buy your Alcatraz souvenir t shirt, in a San Francisco Christmas Wharf, how much do you think the t-shirt gonna cost you? Twenty dollars. How much the same t-shirt? The same quality, the same brand in our